your man and you're not paying no bills <laughs> and that house isn't clean you need to go <laughs> you need to leave he already obviously isn't a organized person if the house is messy anyways and he's already paying the bills so make yourself useful yeah make yourself useful and organize all his shit <laughs> all of it from top to bottom every drawer It'll take you one day if you really dedicate your time, depending on the size of the house. Clean that shit up, bro. <laughs> You're not paying no bills. You're just chilling. That is my dream. <laughs> I'm tired of paying bills. And y'all be living with your boyfriend, not paying nothing. Nothing at all. Those bitches like me, paying everything. And cleaning everything. So if you're gonna be there, at least make yourself useful. I'm dead ass serious. Or somebody like me gonna come scoop in and organize everything. <laughs> Way too much makeup, man. God damn, bro. Um, <laughs> shout out to the notification game for hitting the like button. And the video didn't even start yet. Y'all are realest ones in it. I appreciate you anyway. I did a um. Well, I didn't quote unquote do a video on her. I believe actually no. Did I? I, I think I posted a short of her, one of my YouTube shorts, I believe. I don't think I've actually done, because I think I did, like, maybe post maybe two or three shorts of her. Um, and then I saw this one. I was like, yo, let, let, me, let me just do a video on this one. But anyway, yeah, and in the other videos that I posted of her, the other shorts that I did, um, she didn't have, well, let me not say she didn't have makeup on, but she didn't have as much makeup on as she has now. Because now she damn looks completely different. But as she's walking around the house, I'm like, yeah, I've seen this place before. <laughs> But anyway, yeah, let, let's 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 get, let's get to it, ladies. Listen, 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 listen. The chances of you working after marriage is slim to none, right? Damn near eighty percent of women that's married right now have to work. Damn near eighty percent of women right now that's married is working. What are the chances of you working after you have a baby? I believe seven, what was, I can't, I, I just saw these numbers literally about a week, two weeks ago. I believe it was 77 or 73% of women that had a baby went to work anywhere from three to six months after having, um, after delivering their child, their newborn. And that goes for single and married. So if you have a man that's making enough money putting you into a position to the point where you don't have to worry about paying bills. I mean, I agree with it. The least you can do is damn clean this stuff up. That's the least you can do. I mean, seriously. If you're sitting at home all day, not doing anything, or maybe, maybe you're, you know, I mean, you, you, you could, you could be cleaning. Hell, you could damn be using your time wisely and rolling in school trying to help his vision. Maybe he's working at, you know, what, whatever place and, and, and you ran out to go buy his, his, or make his, create his lunches for him. Iron his clothes out if, if, if he, if he's like me working a, a, a corporate office job. You can do something as simple as that. Ironing his clothes off for the week, having his lunch made or dinner made or whatever. Hell, drawing his goddamn bath when he, as soon as he gets home from work. Little stuff like that lets us know that you are in it to win it. You actually care about me as your man? Like, just little small things like that. And I laughed at well, what she said towards the end. She's like, oh, you need to do this because a girl like me will swoop in and, and start organizing everything. <laughs> That's real. Again, too much goddamn makeup, man. I don't, I don't, I don't get why y'all be doing that couturing, whatever y'all call that crap. I don't know. But this is the truth of the matter, man. So now let's look at the opposite side. Right, where I said majority of women that uh, that's married has to work, right? Majority of women that had a baby had to go back to work. I've told y'all before, my, I had a cousin of mine that had a baby, and I believe within a couple days, if not a week, she was back standing on her feet after having a goddamn epidural, back standing on her feet, lifting up this, lifting up that at her job. And I'm looking at her like, yo, this is insane. This is insanity. How are you back to work? I've said this before with... um. I believe I said this with uh with with, with Jay. Shout out to Jay, man. Uh, I'm supposed to be doing another video with her on her channel, but shout out to Jay, man. 
I was saying that, yo, listen, like we need to, um, you know, I, I want to put myself in a position to the point where if my wife does not want to work after having a baby six months, hell, a year, two years after having our child, then that's fine. She doesn't have to if she does not want to. That's the type of that is the type of time that I'm on. That's the type of position I'm trying to put myself in so I can be able to look out for us as a unit, as a family. That is the difference. That's the difference. So it's unfortunate. Yo, I get it. Like, like I said, again, majority of women that's going to go back to work. It's unfortunate that, that you're going to have to go back to work it's the hell after having a child. But that's the way the world works. It's unfortunate. I, I know everybody wants to live this damn stupid ass Instagram life. I get that. Everybody wants to do it. Bro, cool. But y'all need to understand something. Not everybody's going to be able to be, be able to buy a brand new goddamn Porsche off the goddamn lot. lot. Majority of y'all can't even now walk inside a goddamn Porsche, um, a, a, a Porsche parking, um, you know, uh, you know, uh, what, what do you call it? A Porsche dealership without them taking you serious. Because the first thing they're going to do is run your credit, ask for some pay stubs, and see that your ass ain't making enough money to afford this goddamn Porsche. Sir, let me go ahead and walk you over to this goddamn Kia dealership real quick. <laughs> it's the goddamn truth. It's the truth, man. What do y'all want me to do? The least you can do, ladies, is clean up. Now, say for example, right, if, if both of y'all work in a full-time job, then, I mean, obviously, it's going to be both of y'all that, that can cook and clean and both of y'all doing this, that, and third. But, hell, ladies, if you work in a part-time job, if you're not even working, period, and he's paying all the bills, the least you, I mean, I shouldn't even have to say this, the least you can do is clean up. That's the least you can do. Again, I, should, I, I shouldn't even have to say this stuff, man, because it should be damn common sense. But, again, in the comment section, bro, all I seen was, oh, I ain't cleaning up nothing. He grown. What's wrong with his arm? What's wrong with his legs? What's wrong with this, that, and third? It's that type of mindset. That's the reason why a lot of y'all, most of y'all are single. That type of mindset, that type of thinking, that's the reason why a lot of y'all, most of y'all will probably never get married. A baby mama. Oh, hell yeah. Y'all definitely going to be a baby mama for sure. Definitely going to be a baby mama for sure. But for a man to come and take you serious, a lot of guys is not going to be able to put, it's not going to put, not, not want to put up with that type of stuff, man. Nobody wants to damn deal with that. Get the hell out of here. I don't even want to hear. I don't even want to like, I don't even like reading it. <laughs> I don't even like, if I'm being brutally honest, I don't even like hearing this stuff, man. That's crazy to me. That's crazy, man. But anyway, y'all, um, I want y'all to comment down below. Let me know what y'all thought about this video, man. Thanks for watching. And until next time. Please, man, y'all be safe for her, cuz.